guys, what's up? It's Lacey, and today I have a really cool video for you guys. You can make your own chalky paint. Did you know that? I didn't know that. A um, couple things to keep in mind is you have to use it all up. Like, you can't store it away for later, so only make what you need. And I'll get into more details about what amount of paint covers what amount of area. They said that the standard recipe will do one coat of a six drawer dresser. So not exact measurements, but it kind of gives you more of an idea. And um, after doing a little bit more research online, I found that there was like four or five recipes that you can make out of chalky paint, but this is the one I used and I really like it. So it's cost efficient and I honestly would go as far as saying that it works just as good, if not a little better, than the regular store-bought brands. Just my honest opinion. If you guys want to know how to make your own chalky paint in any color, that's like a huge bonus because some chalky paints only come in select colors. So just keep watching this video and I'll let you know how to do it. It's pretty easy, guys. You're gonna need a mixing container, stir sticks, plaster of Paris, latex paint in your desired color, and a paintbrush. regular chalky paint feels like it's sticking onto whatever you're painting where it's like it gives it that nice resistance when you when you paint it feels like it's actually sticking onto it and that's exactly how this felt whereas with a regular latex paint you know it feels like it's like sliding off and it's going everywhere and this was actually a really nice contrast like a very nice first impression so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye guys oh my god this is gonna be so great